All right, time to test what we have wrought here. So we need to leave a gap there. So that we can place this as we go up. may need to tunnel down and replace the whole thing with blocks. Hopefully not, we will see. So, before we test it full length, let's just try it from like here. Okay, we, we may be okay. With the goal, what we should be able to do here without dying is land safely like that. And that should still allow us to access the corner there. Yes, I think that is successful. We are going to want to dig down the other side too, so it's square, but we can deal with that later. But for now, Let's try to get ourselves hurt. Let's press against the wall here. Okay. I think we'll I think we're okay. Hey, listen, I think we're okay is not quite as firm as we might ideally like to be sure of the situation, but you know we're going to need to expand. Fire, we can keep still there for now, I guess. By the time we need it again, we should have something to replace it. We're up to 75 damage. we can swing like this long. Huzzah, there we go. Okay, we've done the hay bales for the moment, but we are going to want the flagstone block. For multiple reasons. So really we should just go ahead and make like another 50 of these or something. What do we have to sell that is worth selling? I don't want to sell the honey. Cotton could be sold. Only have two of that. I don't really see us needing this. I think we literally just need one more. Leather is annoying me considerably. Getting a claw hammer would double our speed here. Do the 
good amount of iron here. Construction tools, how are you looking? 14. Or we should try to see if we can make ourselves. Oh, hey, look at that. To six. Still kind of difficult to see. Definitely want a mining helmet. But I'm not expecting one to get one to like week two or something. Across the board way and check out that place. Oh, there's more corn. That's honestly what I was looking for right now. Trying to see if there's any more corn lying around that we can add. So we can replace that with that. Because that is the only corn. So if we, ideally we probably just want to kill some zombies to try to get Does this require us to find zombies? Though if past patterns are an indication we should expect Wandering hard at some point today to wander on by. As you can see, there we already have enough food for tomorrow. Spikes, so let's make a bunch of wood spikes. If we do have dogs approaching, it's going to be our main defense. Mining tools is 32. Oh, 
look, our corn is already growing-ish. Whoa! Holy shit! That's a fucking zombie bear over there. I don't know how I even lived through that. They were just... Uh, did I miss a... minor sound? Still got to deal with that stuff now, though. Okay, we're gonna put this aside for right now. We got bigger problems. Okay, so we need something to repair. Looks like they didn't do that much damage. I don't know if dropping the spikes helped at all. I thought I was so dead there. Dogs and zombie bears on day five. Bellows, I will need leather and wood.
Alright, you ugly sucker. Come and get me. do a zombie bear war dance, I guess. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know, was it this just the one zombie bear, or were there more? I was almost too much in shock to even really notice. I actually kind of prefer that he come over here. I'd rather replace these spikes. Hey. Son of a bitch. Okay, now we need to check and see how much damage you actually did to the wall there. Under damage there, not too bad. Okay. Well, um, I guess in a sense I now have. Yeah, that was actually. I guess in a sense that gave me enough to make the fort, so. I guess I could be happy in that regard. At the same time, I would have been just fine without finding that on my doorstep. Thank you very much. I didn't even get a credit for killing it, you know, since the spikes probably dealt the last blow. But you know what? I'm happy I just got the hides. You know, I'll show up with my bearskin jacket and people will be like, Wow, that's so cool. Is that genuine zombie bear leather? And I'll be like, oh yes, this is dead. This is zombie leather, alright. Everyone's just going to be so jealous of me. set these up successfully. Voila. So we need the 
glass jars and everything with the snowballs. This gives 15 minutes of melting stuff down. That should be a good start. We've got all of that dealt with. Excellent. Oh, we actually have enough for a poncho. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I don't know if I want that or another forge to start, frankly. Yes, yes, you're hungry. We can get to it. See if we have more zombie dogs and zombie bears hanging out at the farm. Okay, it seems to be clear. But we will need, seriously, we will need to extend that out. Oh, there's a zombie bear. Spikes can we make? Only a few more so far. You know what, I'm gonna make sure, damn sure, that I have a proper greeting set up before I aggro the bear. You can drag them along that, that's needed. Okay, who wants to play? Balkoth is going to be an idiot and aggro the zombie bear. It's a really fun game. Well, the title kind of gives away a lot, frankly. Kind of tempted to go for nice guy. Curious about it. Hello, nice zombie bear. That's bad. Oh fuck, this is bad. Not my proudest moment right there. This has been a very strange day.
Alright, what just happened to its body? The hell? What just happened to its body? The whole reason we did that and nearly got ourselves killed like twice over because uh, the bear is faster than I remember it being. I guess it's even faster than the dogs. I'm not sure how I didn't get killed earlier. Oh, do you slow down when you draw the... I think you moved... I thought you moved at the same rate back. Eh. Well, we didn't waste that much, I suppose, when it comes down to it. We're almost level 18 from that. I don't know, I guess we'll... On one hand, the body glitched out on the whoops side, I should have been so dead there when I didn't have any destroyed that way up. And then I didn't have it, and he glitched out. So I guess we'll call it a, we'll call it a draw. Excellent. Ooh, we can sell the mini bike wheels. We don't actually need them as much, don't need the money as much right now. Nothing I'm urgently needing to buy. Lydix is nearly 18, so that's progress. have our own forge now. So we're going to take this back. Then we're going to make iron bars. And more forged iron. And we'll output all of this. See? We don't need 40 minutes for that. Time. We want several things. We need another pickaxe. We want another fire axe. We want a claw hammer. And we want a shovel, don't we? Like all four of these. And you. Yeah, you. Ah, I've been expecting you. That wouldn't be bad, but it's not really near. Again, the shotgun would be great. He doesn't have a mining helmet, so I'm kind of hoping he'll have a mining helmet soon. Uh, I don't think we really saw anything we cared about before, yeah. Great doing business with you. Come back and tell your friends. Okay. I thought day, I thought the pack of like twelve dogs on day six was bad. Zombie bear day five that probably is beaten it. Like it's just stuff like this. It's like I, I mean, what do you do? Just hide in your base every single day until you see what the horde is. I don't get why you should ever see zombie bears. Week one on a horde that's running towards you, because these, you know, again, these are running towards you. You can't just avoid them. It's stuff like this that makes me not really want to play permanent death.
So if I die to something like that, I'll probably keep going. If I had died to that bear after, uh, I don't know what I would have done. I guess it's a moot point since it had happened. If I, if I had died to the bear to do my own screw up there by getting that thing destroyed and missing the jump, I'm not sure what I would have done. Might have started over on the flip side. The fact that I had the bear in the first place was pretty baloney, so I don't know. Thirty-three mining tools. I'm going to definitely go back and review this video later on and see if I missed any warning sound of the bears and the dogs. I'm trying to find the rocks. This rain is surprisingly more difficult. So yeah, we should already have enough iron to make our, our iron bars. That should be ready to harvest tomorrow or the day after. Holy shit, that are, I'm sorry for language and everything earlier, but holy shit, that game earlier. That hack attack earlier. Well, just a cloud burst, I guess. Didn't last very long. But X is now 18, excellent. So that's doing 43, this aims to be doing 50. Farmer dude. Come at me.
trees we can plant. I thought it was something there. Got herself a claw hammer too. We have gotten some of the rocks over here. Right? rocks we can harvest over here. Four hundred sixty-nine iron already, so four six nine. Let's see where we are after this rock. Six, so we gained 37 iron there. And we're level 19. So we're definitely going to want those trees to grow and or go into the forest to harvest more. So our next level, we're going to gain 20% more damage. We're already at 20 though, so that's really like 15% more damage, and we'll gain about 15% more harvested. So probably going up from like 18 to 23, 24 per swing would be my guess. Wait, or does it jump up higher than that this time? Oh, oh, this time we're only going from... Yeah, it's actually a smaller bit buff up than that. I'll probably... Probably go from like, uh... What, 18 to... 22 or something.
And this is a vein for iron, so in theory we could continue the excavation later on if we wanted. You can tell it's vein for iron because we get one iron when we finish digging this the section, if you weren't aware of that little tidbit. Athletics is improving. See, we're at about 3.5 on the clay. Halfway to the next level. Just as you know, a reminder, the next level is when we go up to quality 200 here. Since a little hiccup. I go, was it here, right around here? There he is. Alright, come on. Hello, boys. This is a lot of zombies for a horde. And only 56 arrows, so that's like a marine. There's level 20.
think it's what we want to be from hitting her head from down here. Like, excuse me, I'm trying to kill your buddies. You kindly stop messing with me. That, not bad. up a whole level there. Aren't there like zombie bodies over here if they kill any bunch of them? Aha. Uh -huh. The new question is what do we actually need for tonight? We do want to melt those down. Don't care about the cotton or the rotting flesh. Or the balance, we don't ever care about the glass panel. Don't care about the stone axe, we're gonna might as well have that. What a day. Zombie bears. Zombie dogs. Another zombie horde right before night. Things are certainly exciting here, so I'm gonna make sure just in case I keep the ability. Let's also do this. Um, Let's just start melting stuff down here, shall we? And those get melted. These all get sold. I'll start setting them up proper stuff too. Fat cloth fragment in wood. 
Each one's worth eight coins, though. Let's just buy the torch from downstairs. I don't know if we have enough cobblestone for everything right now. Sorry, I've just been listening for zombies. Level 21. So we grab the older knot of flowers. So I think that was everything, right? We've, we have done everything there. Excellent. Yes, yes, you're thirsty, we get it. is already down there. Nearly to 37 mining tools.
definitely missing the mining helm. Definitely, definitely. So here's the catch. I was originally going to have this be the bottom layer. I think I'm going to do it. In theory, having the main level be even one layer further down would be even safer. Because then you can see damage done to this layer. Alright, so we got everything there. Alright, I guess we should have checked in on this, shouldn't we? Oh, and there's the anvil at the other place that we should make sure we get to. Uh -huh. Drink up, my heart is your home. And we will plant goldenrod flowers as well. This must look a lot nicer. We're gonna have a forge there, another two forges here, and then a bunch of storage boxes. That is our eventual goal. A minute to melt down. We are going to want to start our basement. We'll put things like the workbench and chemistry station. Okay, so where do we want to make this? We can do it not quite in the corner, but how about one over from the corner? So we're over here. I'm going to start digging north. We're going to start killing this in six per swing. It's our seven, sorry. So that's an improvement too. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
So we'll be close to level 2, 22 by the end of the night, and we will have plenty of forged iron to make more tools. We're just going to need a lot of wood. And we should go change. See that little snag right there? That's what I'm gonna have to dig, dig down to avoid having a problem. On iron bars, you need the anvil, so we'll grab, grab the anvil, that's all fine. And we'll just let you melt down. more athletics to go until we get another boost there. I right, can hear at least one zombie going by upstairs and dying. Not a way to put it against the wall unless I thought it's better. No, it's not, it's not how it's supposed to go. in the next version of all of these. What does the wooden bell require at this point? Requires eight, okay. So that would be enough. Alright, so that's for us to get a better wooden bow. I see we're at the point we need to add another one on. Two more mining skill to go. So on day 6 we will have quality 200 tools, and we will have minor 69 or rank 4 out of 5. And we're going to go be a cyclone of tree destruction. Nearly at level 22. Alright, let's get back to the surface and be ready to go about our day.